This is a sulfide case, uh, so 25 m L of uh, sample water. Put it in, and a few scoop of the starch indicator. Starch indicator. One, two. I think it called for three of them. Huh? Okay. Oh, we don't have too much. Huh? Okay, now. And then we stir it a little bit. We stir a little bit. It's still nice and clear. Huh? Ah, so we have to try three. We have uh, potassium, iodide, iodine. Okay. So the first thing you want to do uh, right now uh, is not zero. Uh, we have to make it zero first. Uh, so what you do, uh, you squeeze it up a little bit and let it go. Uh, drop down to zero. And then we start the tritration. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. You see the color change? The color change to, to, to black. Uh, okay. But it's not permanent. Uh, we want a permanent color. So one, uh, let's say we do it a little bit slower. Uh, one drop, two drop. Oh, you see, one extra drop. Eh? The whole thing changed the color. Eh? So that is my end point. Eh? Now I'll do the reading. Right now it is. Uh, so it's uh, probably one one mL. Eh? Okay, it's something around one one mL. Okay, then so I'll turn a little bit in here. Oh no, no, it was zero point five. <laughs> Only zero point five. Eh? Okay. So now, in 0 0.5, uh, we have to go to the multiplier. If you go to the, the, the book, uh, and look, for, look for the multiplier, okay? Now let's see what, what is the multiplier. The multiplier for the sulfide test uh, is 20. 20, uh, 0 0.5 times 20 is 10. So I get 10 ppm of sulfide in this sample. Okay, good, thank you.